So the National Democratic Congress, after the demise of their leader, uh, Flight Lieutenant Jerry John Rawlings, on Thursday, um, held a political committee meeting to come up with ways to honor their leader. One of these ways in, uh, which came up includes the positioning of the Book of Condolence for persons um, who would want to show their last respect to sign. And here at the national headquarters here at Adabraka in Accra, the book has been placed um, in the office. You can clearly see that um, the premises of um, the NDC headquarters had, has been clad in red and black. This is all to mourn the former president. Let me run you by um, some of the persons we understand have signed. And so the book was placed here on Friday at about 1 p.m. We understand that the first person to sign the book of condolence is the flag bearer for the party. That is John Germani Mahama. So he has signed and we understand that the party and uh, some of the party executives, including the national um, chairman, um, Mr. Ufusu Ampofo, has also signed. Also, we understand that today being a uh, Saturday, some persons have come in um, to sign the book of condolence. And so at about uh, three, as I speak to you now, persons um, numbering about 10 to 15 have already signed the book of condolence. What inspiration do you draw from the former president? For which reason you've come here to sign the book of condolence? Okay, we all grew up knowing former Rollins, um, the former president, J.J. Rollins, as an inspirational leader, a very charismatic and infectious leader. And so as a youth group, we take that inspiration from him for the ideals he stood for, probity, accountability, and integrity. And when we look at the current corruption that has engulfed the nation as a youth group, we know that we need to arise and shine because the youth has been alienated from governance and as a youth group we want to come together and make sure that the ideals of former President Rawlings in terms of probity, probity and accountability is rife. What do you think that the country needs to do, especially um, taking a cue from the former president? Um, like my colleague rightly said, he was more interested in accountability, holding people accountable to um, their actions. For me, I think that is what we should look up to. Um, people should be held accountable for what they do. Um, we, sh we, should, we should, as youth especially, we shouldn't just go thinking that we have the freedom and we can do whatever we like. We understand that tomorrow the party will be holding a vigil um, that is from the party headquarters here in Accra all the way to a brass spot at the Kwame Nkrumah Circle. And all these activities are to mourn the death of their former um, leader, and that is Jerry John Rawlings. Reporting for City News from the Adabraka head office of the NDC, my name is Kweku Adiyama Ansa.